Hey y'all and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This week I'm sharing with you my Christmas home tour. I shared this same video last week with just music and now I'm interested to see who watches that video versus who likes a more scripted tour, uh, guided tour if you will. So um, starting off in my dining room area, I kept it very simple. I mostly used things I already had. There are a couple of things that I thrifted this year and some new decorations I bought for Halloween, like these curtain lights I used on the mantle. But mostly I just put some faux garland everywhere. I used these candle holders I thrifted a few years ago and I just love these new faux cedar garlands from Anthropology. I made that pine cone wreath last year and I just was very simple yet um, intentional with where I put things. And I think just having ribbon and greenery everywhere with cozy lighting uh, is really all you need at Christmas. Um, and it just fits my more vintage and old world style Christmas decorating. I actually really love the pheasant feathers in the crock on the table as well. And so that is the dining room area. The way my home is set up, the back door that leads to the garage is right here to the right of this little area. And we used to have our trash can here, but uh, when we added it to a cabinet, I was able to make this um, more functional area with a table and a little cubby area. And I've just added, again, some faux greenery stems and some ribbon and the Christmas trees that we DIY'd a couple of weeks ago with the mercury glass look and some more vintage uh, thrifted pieces. And in the kitchen, I added that tree to the bowl I thrifted and then just added some greenery and some orange slice garlands that I made uh, a couple of years ago over some more faux greenery. I put some above my pot rack as well and added some just greenery here and there to my cutting board wall and then I have this little alcove slash hallway by my stairs. I love how the greenery looks with the French horn. These are two more of those faux cedar garlands uh, from Anthropology, and I like the French horn there. And I added another French horn in the little powder room area. Y'all have seen this room a bunch of times, but here are just a few things I added to it for Christmas, like this little primitive tree I have in the ironstone and the faux Christmas tree. And then I also added some greenery and ribbon above the mirror on the light. And I really love how that can just dress up a whole area, a mirror or a light or a candlestick. It really makes uh, it feel festive in a smaller room. Moving on to the shelves in my living room. These are always fun to style. I love using vintage Christmas books in here. And I have the pine cones in a little ironstone dish. And I put some faux greenery under the sailboat next to the candle snuffer. And uh, then I have a little bell garland hanging from one of the shelves. And then this little bell that I thrifted years ago that was a dollar and my kids just love it. And I love, um, I kind of have a bell theme going on here 
and uh, then I have some vintage sleigh bells and a smaller French horn here on the door of the pantry. I like the combination of the gold with the cedar. I think that just looks beautiful. The living room is really simple this year. I have just tucked greenery everywhere I could think of on the table. I've put a wreath on the window, a faux tree on the little table. Uh, there's sprigs on the entertainment center and on the little shelves behind us. And of course on the mantel, I love taking different greeneries and tucking them all in together to make it look like it is foraged. And my tree is a collection of ribbon slash vintage or thrifted ornaments. And there are a couple on there that I DIY'd before with you guys, the faux floral ornaments and some more thrifted ornaments. Moving on to the entryway, I DIY'd these uh, little pots into an antique bell garland slash little cluster with you guys last week and or a couple of weeks ago and I uh, love how those turned out and uh, in the entryway I have really just added to my everyday decor some greenery under the duck with a ribbon, adding some ribbon to the candle sconces here, adding more greenery to this archway and to the window in the playroom. Here is a shot of the other candle sconce with some ribbon on it. I love that coppery brown color. I've left the candlesticks up from Halloween and added some more greenery to this window along with some hanging paper stars. And that's pretty much the end of the tour. I am really excited with the direction the Christmas decorating is going, but there's probably gonna be a little bit more added here and there. And we have lots of fun Christmas DIYs coming up. So please consider subscribing and giving this video a thumbs up. And as always, thank you so much for stopping by the mansion. And I will see y'all next time. Bye-bye.